Hello, welcome back to the channel. In this episode, we give the sidekick the pack that he needs to survive and a random engine change. I can't think why. Cue the intro. Okay, so let's catch you up to speed. In the last few days, certain items have arrived that the sidekick needs, and it's a sidekick starter pack. Now, he needs these items to survive for his protection. Being a global sensation YouTube star channel that we are, his popularity is growing, and there's concerns. So I've got to get him what he needs to survive and have a better life. So I've put that together for his own little starter pack. So I dropped him a text message a couple of days ago to say, we need to meet ASAP, this is vitally important. And I got a reply saying, I'm busy tonight, but come down to the garage on Thursday, because I've bought an engine and I'm putting it in. And I thought, hang on a minute, we've just put an engine in already. Yeah, it sounded like a bag of nails, Woo, good for me in the race. The only thing I can think of, he's bought a bigger CC engine, or, He's bought something to put in there that could possibly cheat. So we need to investigate that. Now, I can already hear people saying in the background, why are you driving the car? The sun's out. Well, it's only just come out, literally, as I've been driving. So yesterday I was out actually filming for the channel. Beautiful day. And from nowhere was a massive thunderstorm. And within 10 minutes, my entire gear got soaked through. So it's currently drying out. But not just that. I was still going to risk it because I'm a true well art biker. I had another text message from the sidekick asking to borrow a pressure washer to clean this engine. I can only think it's an old engine, maybe a zillion cc that he's putting in. So I've had to put the pressure washer in the back. I've got quite a big box for his sidekick stuff and I brought some beers. So anyway, let's go and investigate what the sidekick's up to and give him the pack that he needs to survive. Ask you a serious question. When did you get your chemical qualification to pressure wash? <laughs> Shiny hands car wash. Shiny hands car wash. <laughs> From my Polish friends. <laughs> so I've got to ask the question again. Have you gone out and bought a bigger CC engine so you can beat me yet again? Because this is isn't this the third engine? This no, this is this second engine that's in one piece, so, sort of in one piece. So what CC is that then? And then, is that hole there? I mean look, it has got a hole in it. So. Is that hole there though where you spray the NOS in? Yeah, I can't I can't tell you, this is top secret. This See, I think we need to go back to the truth, you're cheating still, to try and win the race. I know you've seen the monkey bike try to get to 100 miles an hour and obviously in pure skill and style so you've got concerns I can understand that but buying you know getting three scooters to make one is getting a little bit excessive now <laughs> I prefer that to yours so yeah I did, <laughs> did have to I did go and buy uh, well, I said I went to buy another engine, but there was just happened to be a bike attached to it. Yeah, so you've got three bikes. Yeah. So you're going to make it. So you're going to make at least two. Well, I'll be happy to make one at this point. Wow, that looks nice. <laughs> bit, a little bit of like, bit of like, yeah, a bit of like buffing out. I reckon that'll look like brand spanking you. Yeah, maybe. I'll buy it off you for fifty quid. With the engine in and running and MOT <laughs> <laughs> and ready for the road. And as long as it's got the bigger CC engine in. Yeah. I mean, I can't state of it. I don't think it's um, intelligent to spend a lot of money. 
give it another go to this because this will uh... And then, again, on serious questions, because, again, talking to one professional to another, what is your favourite pucker pie? Because I think that's really important. It's always between steak, steak or chicken and mushroom. So you're a 50-50 man? Steak and kidney or chicken and mushroom, it depends what, what mood I'm in. Uh, you don't think that's a bit wrong? Well, being 50-50, that's like saying I'm not sure if I'm a man or a woman. Well, no, because certain pies go better with certain things, don't they? So it depends what the situation is and what you're doing. Okay. Usually I prefer steak and kidney. Okay. But sometimes I like a good chicken and mushroom. And would you say pucker pie or ginster's pie? Pucker. Definitely pucker. Yeah, pies, yeah. Okay. So if you're having a pasty, you have a ginster's. Okay, you just passed the test, <laughs> the sidekick test, because it was make or break if you were going to come the sidekick, depending on your pie preference. Right. But you've you've well done, you've passed. Oh, thanks. Congratulations, you're now the sidekick to the channel. I feel completely underwhelmed. This is the moment, okay? In this box is everything that you need. Now, I had general concern for when you became world famous <laughs> that you were gonna get hunted down by the women. I thought you need an outfit because you're now officially the sidekick and you need to feel a better life. So right. everything in here is for your survival and your well-being, all right? So the outfit we'll start off with, what's important, is this, okay? Now this here is the T-shirt so everybody knows exactly who you are, okay? So on here, you've got the sidekick, and I know you like to say you're not, so you've got not. Okay, okay so that covers you, we that's can, yours. We can just about live with that. And that, and what's coming out next, are the two things that are on the store, so if anyone else wants to take the place, they can go and buy it. <laughs> and they can become a, somebody <laughs> will, then. a sidekick too. Okay, and then, because of, <clears throat> Everything in a helmet head mug tastes better, and I mean like a thousand times better. I thought you deserve a sidekick's mug. Now this is guaranteed that everything in here, once you drink out of it, will be 5% better. Okay? 5%? Yeah, 5% better. So that's yours. Okay? Sidekick's mug, almost as good as helmet head mug. Right. You sorted. So does that mean yours, it tastes better out of yours? Yeah, mine's like a thousand times better. That's 5%. But every single cup of coffee, every wine you have, buy the cheap stuff, it will taste a little bit less cheap. Only buy the cheap stuff anyway. There you go then, pour the cheap stuff in. It's like if you poured in, for instance, a, an own brand, that might taste like a Stella. So it, it's okay. an improvement. Where mine's like the, like the like when I pour wine into mine, it makes it into one of the most expensive, handcraft, award-winning wines. Yours will make it just taste a little bit better. But you've got a mug, so you're no, now thank part you. of the team. And then the other thing is, right, because you said you use links, and that's a big concern. Now, you must have noticed the difference already. The women, the pressure, you must feel like you're having to look behind your back. So for that reason, I went out and bought you your own special can of Brute, okay? This is what you need to wear because it's the only thing that will keep them away. Trust me on this, right. it's scary. When they come, you could, if you stood down on a beach, thousands would run. Thousands without They usually this. run, it's in the opposite direction. <laughs> Thousands. Use that, be safe. Thank you. And then when it all gets a little bit much, you always deserve a bit of a finger. <laughs> <laughs> so, when it gets a bit much and you need a bit of Dutch courage, you have a bishop's finger, all right? And that will keep you safe. And that's everything that you need. That's about the best thing, isn't it, Alan? Thanks. Because you like a good finger. I like a good finger. <laughs> it's a bit concerning. I do like a good finger. So there you go, you've got everything you need, you've got your outfit, you've got things will taste a bit better, improvement, you've got your protection, and then you've got your Dutch courage. So it's done. It's amazing. Now you are the I'm, official sidekick. I don't know what to say, I feel, like, I feel like I should make a speech, but... Don't cry. I'm not I was really... a bit worried about you crying, to be honest. I can see it in your yeah. eyes now. I do feel like crying, to be honest. So there you go. I don't know what the reasons are beyond that. Congratulations. 
Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> so, I feel that went really well. I think uh, you could see that he was almost crying with excitement about becoming the official helmet head sidekick. He has his survival pack now, so the women should stay away as his fame continues to grow. And you can see that he's very nervous about the intensity that he's going to get the fan club and the ladies chasing him. Now he is the official sidekick of the channel. Anyway, the Vespa is going in for an MOT tomorrow. He's swapping the engine out potentially uh, that night. And ideally, if all goes according to plan, we will have the Monkey Vespa race coming up very soon and very soon on the channel. So I'm very excited. Um, I'm going to continue to go into full training mode. I'm aiming to eat as many pies as possible. An ideal world is I'll pick a downhill uh, slope so we can race because he's skinnier than me so uh, I'll get a bit of an advantage there that's the plan um, and obviously we're racing for slippers so one of us is going to win the prize the slippers at the end of the race anyway as always what I want to turn around and say is a massive thank you to my patrons they're the guys that every single month they they sign up to Patreon and they send me a little bit of money and that helps fund this channel and uh, it helps create these hugely, highly, massively production videos. Um, as always as well, I want to say thank you to my subscribers. You guys are the ones that are subscribed to the channel and you're regular viewers and you, think, and you have your regular comments and I massively appreciate that as well. As always, before you disappear, please don't forget to give the channel a thumbs up on this video. Don't forget to leave a nice comment, that's always lovely. And remember the most important thing in life, eat pies, ride a motorcycle, be happy. Bye-bye. See you next time.